A piece of art has been added to the Connecticut River Conservancy in Greenfield. 22 News reporter Mike Mascadrelli joins us from our Franklin County Bureau to tell us why the likeliness of a shad is on display there. The Connecticut River Conservancy said the shad sculpture serves as a reminder as to why they protect the river. The Connecticut River Conservancy has added something new to the front of their building. A stainless steel shad sculpture was mounted outside the entrance on Thursday. Nat Cohen created it. It's native to the Connecticut River. It was fished a lot in Holyoke. It's got associations with the river. The CRC operates out of the old Franklin County Courthouse on Bank Row in Greenfield. They said the shad sculpture matches the architecture of the historic building. This sculpture represents the Connecticut River Conservancy's new logo. The American Shad swims up from the Atlantic Ocean to the Connecticut River each spring, but the CRC says the species is in decline. River steward Andrea Donlin said the shad population is higher in the Connecticut River than other bodies of water. Shad in general have been declining, so in the Hudson River the numbers have gone way down. In the Connecticut River we haven't seen a precipitous drop, they've actually been doing better. Donlin told 22 News they're working to increase the shad population by improving water quality and reducing the number of dams that prevent the fish from spawning. The scientific name of the American shad is Alosa sapidissima, which translates to most savory herring, but most people don't eat shad because it has a lot of bones. Reporting from the Franklin County Bureau in Greenfield, Mike Mascadrelli, 22 News.